both both games in the first inning, we kind of, I don't know what happened there, I don't know, maybe adrenaline or something. So we kind of had a couple defensive miscues in, in, in the first game, first inning, same in the second. But once JD got settled down, um, you know, he's, I think he's that type of pitcher. I mean, he's a true number one, a shutdown guy. So even though we, we fell behind early, it, it just, you know, with, with him on the mound and knowing that he's gaining in confidence and what he is and, and what he can be, um, we're never really worried. And then, you know, with the lineup that we have, you know, I just really felt felt good about things, and it was just fun watching them play. You know, it was just fun watching these guys hit and play. And uh, you know, man, I was just trying to see the ball, drive the ball opposite way. Um, you know, basically, the, I'm trying to get the W. That's all that matters. You know, any way I can to move runners over. And uh, you know, it just happened that I just got all those hits. They came day in, day out. JD, you're gonna get his best every single day. Uh, you know, that's why he's our Friday night guy, our number one guy, because he go out, compete, dominate, dominates the guys. You know, when we back him up with some offense, you know, we can go a long way this year. Yeah, you know, that's, um, well, first of all, the Wilson. You know, Wilson um, did a phenomenal job in the first inning keeping it at one run. And, you know, when we talk about that to the guys, you know, you, you know, the, the difference making innings can be in the first inning, second inning, fourth inning, you know, and everybody, and it's really easy as, as a player to think, oh, you know, seventh, eighth, ninth, and that's where you lose the games. But a lot of times they're won or lost early by by minimizing damage, you know. So Wilson did a really good job of that because that first inning could have turned into a three-run inning and he kept it at one. Um, you know, everybody, as usual, our pitching staff is really deep. Um, and they were on point today, which is great. They're always usually pretty sharp. So it was nice seeing them all out there and putting their best effort in. I, they're bullpen guys, slider guys, you know, they're off speed guys. And I think we set the focus on hitting their off speeds, you know, and producing runs, you know, like you've seen, put the ball in play, their guys will make mistakes, you know, and I think we can capitalize on that. The only thing on my mind was just keep, give my team a chance to win, um, just keep them where they're at and kind of just went in there with the bulldog mentality, just trying to bear down. Um, made it a little interesting with the walk, you know, had that all planned in my back pocket. No. But um, no, it was, uh, it was definitely big, but like I said, the whole staff did great today. So, and it was, it was two collectively like team wins. So um, definitely give credit to everyone else too. We have to carry, carry the learning into Monday and, um, you know, but I love, the, I love this team. I love this team and I love these guys and how they approach things. And, and as you can see, there's really no quit in them. So, um, I look forward to Monday and going to war and hopefully um, the weather holds and we can get those two in.